Oasis rocker Liam Gallagher has hit out at Mercury Prize shortlisted Irish band Phonanes DC, after two band members admitted they weren't fussed about the hugely hyped Oasis reunion tour. Speaking to Studio Brussels last week, guitarist Carlos O'Connell and bassist Connor Deegan III were asked how they were feeling about the news that Oasis will reunite for a huge tour in 2025. I couldn't really give AS asterisk asterisk asterisk, to be honest, O'Connell responded. I'm not excited about it either, to be honest, Deegan agreed. Because I just feel like we kind of get caught. In the last year, 2010s, into such a nostalgic thing, that we're forgetting to make new things, and I've felt like, what we wanted to do with this record anyway, where we wanted to make our minds look into the future and making new things. Never one to bite his tongue, Gallagher responded to a fan account who shared an article covering the band's comments, writing, F asterisk 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 them little spunk bubbles I've seen better dressed roadies. Suffice to say, Fontaine's DC might not be at the top of the list when Oasis get around to announcing their support acts. But it's unlikely Deegan or O'Connell would be that bothered. Either. Frontman Brian Chatton clarified his position in a post on an enemy Instagram report on the incident, writing, I love Oasis. This is not my opinion. The band have just released their new album. Romance, which received a glowing four-star review from the independent's Mark Beaumont. Liam has previously told fans that Fontaine's DC are the favorite band of his son, Gene Gallagher, who fronts the rock group Villanelle. Earlier this week, the Independent learnt that Liam and his brother, Noel, have yet to sit down and work out which artists will open for them at their shows in London, Cardiff, Manchester, Edinburgh and Dublin next year. While several reports have claimed that various bands are already lined up for the honour, a source close to the band told the Independent that those conversations are still to be had. Liam is keen for established acts so it will probably take a bit of back and forth before anything's confirmed.